Welcome to Atlanta Motor Speedway at night. Ever since we hit the night, wait, no, actually, I should Never stop saying that. Start your engine! You can get real wild here at Atlanta. We've seen a lot of nasty wrecks, crazy finishes, and more nasty wrecks. Mary Shelley sitting on the pole for today's brace. Cole Chambers, another front row start for him. Crispy creme. I know it's cream, but it looks like creme to me. Oh yeah, new series. SK modified crispy creme. Cream. It looks like we already have problems with the 20th Joseph Curtis. Oh man, this season not going good for him. Signing over to a bigger or a uh, bigger team did not help his chances of winning more races and so many heartbreaks upsets for him no no he upsets someone a lot of surprise winners this season he doesn't lower, uh, lower the team the more chances he got winning because uh, he just signed the 51 last season Phoenix Racing took two wins I believe in this season, Nick Purcells has three wins. George Roke, a couple of Daytona wins this season. Uh, but uh, take an example of my team. I'm still bragging about my team. Has not won yet. What in the truck series? Yes. But I'm not gonna rig the race or, or any kind of race like that to have my team win. But no matter. Green flags out. Get off to a good start. 20 still on, on his pit stall. 7 taking over. And second, I'm making the move for the lead. Michael Nevins in the zero car. An unknown team. Custom painted by someone in the online series. Uh, online part. Oh, giving the 7 a little tap. Look at that. 3 wide. Here we go. Mary Shelley gets off with a good run because those two drivers make contact there. She leads the first lap. Look at the 23 car. Looking to be the first driver with four and becoming the three third driver to have four all time in one season. Two have only done it. One is in this field and another one has been kicked out for inactivity. He dropped a double zero car for a while. And they still have not wrecked yet, I'm surprised. And the seven's going after it again. We're seeing a lot of new robberies here. The 48 and the 05 is one of them. Little talk after Watkins Glen after they uh, kept touching. Not, don't think dirty now. Got beaten and banging. Almost tried to wreck him. Chambers tried to wreck Laplante a couple of times. He didn't like that. Mary Shell is just sitting on the top. Phil Chambers back to second. Four wide. Almost. Gotta use them that high side. Here we go. I like the spectator cam. Why can't all tracks have a spectator cam like that? Has a 20 even moved? The 20 has. I think has. I think. Not to put it behind the wall. Mary Shelley with a good lead. Still side by side. A 22 and a 24. High side. Launches off the high side. High side is good at Atlanta. But it could get you into a lot of wrecks here. We still haven't wrecked. We ran five laps without a wreck. Oh, 98 in the wall. I knew someone went into the wall. He's going to go falling back to last. And 99 just to squeeze right through. Went sideways. Look at how fast. Oh, contact. Debris on the track. Debris on the track. No caution. No caution. I think that was Ponder who hit that one. And oh, there we go, Stevens again upside down for the second race in a row and probably the third time ever and still getting hit. Oh, he's kind of saved it. Oh, man. Mario Stevens is getting the rookie flip curse. As I mentioned before, it happened to Hayden when he was a rookie, when he's just upcoming. He's an upcoming driver and now it's happening to Mari Stevens. I believe that's the third time that's happened and she has a lot of hard wrecks already this season and her night is already done and Mary Shelley is the leader we'll take a look at the replay what are the odds of flipping over for the second race in a row yep somewhat of the same situation uh, the way she flipped no wall help 
just a car hitting her and then she going f up and over and then PJ Williams got some more here and George Rook just missed that one and car is smoking so for sure that car is done the chances of fixing the okay I gotta stop saying that it don't matter anyways Ponder was involved he also has heavy damage that's the first caution we'll take you back pit stops were being made two cars out the 38 with the tire problem he's out 26 of course is also out so a total of two cars out of the race make that three if you want to count to 20 no I should count to 20 actually 37 drivers are left pace cars heading down pit row Mary Michael Brian Hayden and Chambers here we go getting ready for the green and oh Michael Lemon look at that car sink he knew he had, he had a, looks like he had, might have had a misshift or something. Was the chef? Misshift or broke something. My 22 got a run on the bottom. Mary looking for her second win of the season. Her first came in at a auto club. Uh, she's also flipped over twice this season as well. Michael Nevins, Coke 600 winner. Oh, Coke, Coke 600. Going side by side, got some help trying to get ourselves a new leader here. Unless that 19 could get the run, unless a zero can look at that 19 all the way up top. The seven on the bottom, make it three wide again for the lead. Make that side by side, make it clear. The 19 is strong. With weather like this, my high lane is pretty much it's perfect. The 12, he's going down pit road. Something is wrong. I don't know what, but he's going back down there. And well, they're going after it again. A zero. Trying to get it. Oh no! He wrecks the 19 wrecks. The leaders have wrecked and big hit the points leader involved. It's gonna take out a lot of drivers here. Oh boy. Oh the one almost upside down. Actually it didn't take a lot as I expected. Big hit by the Roush Fenway cars. Both of them out of the race for sure. Race it back, the leader this time will be the 22 car. Prime Minister. Caution is out, we'll take a look. See the 22 had a good run, was leaning on a 19 and then turned her around right in front, I mean into the zero, not in front. And those two leaders wrecked Mary Shelley. And then there's LaPlante into Michael Nevins, he's the points leader, then the 39, then the 34. Man, when, if you if you wreck right in front of the pack, for sure you're gonna have a lot of hard hits. Look at this thing, big wreck right there. The four in the air, the one spinning around. The two got into uh, Malik Nevins. Watch that 17 and watch the then 32 actually had some contact and watch the 16 uh, uh, 16 of DJ Curtis hard on the driver's door. My God, that was bad. Three Roush Fenway cars involved in that one. Wow, what a hit that was. And uh, the plant, as I mentioned many times, he is the points leader. Looking for his first champion in this series, or in the league. It'd be pretty cool to win in the top level. And uh, yeah, we'll take you back. More pit stops were being made, of course. 27 drivers left, and 12 will once again go back down pit road. The 22 is still leading. Followed by the 7, 11, 24, 23, and the 8, 18, 6, 9, 13, 10. Everyone else. Alright, green flag. And oh, the 7 looks like he got a good start. He's already looking to the inside. The 11 did not, of course. Here comes the 24. Quickly down to the bottom. Nick Prosos will follow. 24, 23. Trying to clear. Got that 11 with a bad start right there. Lots of damaged cars back there, too. This could, uh... Close another one. 15 with heavy damage. Bad luck. Awesome. The three trying to get right by. So is the 99. Oh, the nine all the way down in the grass and onto the apron. And saved it. Man, what a save that was. Contact again. Three wide here. They played safety. 89 falls right behind the 13. The 22 is still leading. The seven is in second. There's 24 and battle for fourth. Two Camrys and teammates as well. Make it three wide. Teammates aren't gonna help. 18 falling back right behind the 23. He might get past. Could be three wide again. Can get the run. He's gonna get that run. 
The seven trying to get the lead. Another driver who uh, not won this season. Uh, Sam Curtis with one. Nick Curtis with three. Phil with one. Brian, I forgot. But he's also another driver who's been flipping a lot. I think he flipped two times already. I know first lap Vegas. So the the 24 got a good run entering turns one, two. Well, actually, just turn one. The seven try to get it. Oh, whoa, 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 we got wrecked. And there goes Sam Curtis as well. Who else involved? The 10, the 13. Who else? Who else? Lots of cars on the wall. This could cause another wreck right in front of the pack. Who's going to get hit? The 2. The 24 gets in, gets into it again. Oh my god. Oh. 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 <laughs> Thomas Shelley upside down again. Oh shit. I almost fell. I'm laughing so hard. How that 15 just came out of nowhere. Oh boy. That was funny. Let's take a look at the replay. The 24 car Phil Chambers thought he was... Oh, actually, Nick Purcells came down and took him out. Sam Curtis, heavy damage onto the bottom of the 10 with the little bit. The 13, little piece, little piece. Yeah. Okay. Lots of drivers going up in the wall right there. Had to avoid and They're still slamming into each other. But look at this. The first, the two. Hard impact. Where's the 15? There he is. He's flipped over again. A lot of drivers flipping. Watch this wreck. He didn't even slow down. Barely. He gets into the 2, but then he got the little tap into the 23. The 2 car upside down. The 15 upside down. Woo! Wait, the 2 go all the way over? I wasn't paying attention. I think he did. And that 15 car upside down again. Look at that again. Look at that fast uh, full motion. Wow. Just came out of nowhere. Okay, that's not funny. Okay. Okay, reverse that again. And then watch the 15 come into play. Yeah, motherfucker. <laughs> okay. Enough bullshitting. We'll take you back. Getting ready for the restart. Most of the drivers did not pit on this caution. The one behind the 22 has pitted. I think. Pace cars in 7, 8, oh wait, 11, 31. Here we go. Not a lot of laps left. They're gonna take the gamble here. Will they make it? Oh, the 8 spun them tires. I don't know if they are gonna make it. A 22, of course, with uh, big fresh tires and gas. Quickly jump to the inside. 3 wide here. 6 and the 22. Trying to work. The 22 is on a mission. Look at him go. He knows he can win this race. He's a fast enough car. But I don't think Mary Shelley's gonna like it when that 22 goes to victory lane. They are gonna have a talk after this. Ah, we mean talk, I mean fight. Mary Shelley has made now two rivals now. Ian Siegel and now Brian Minister. Oh, car in the wall, the 31. He's in the, he's now cracked the top five. The old way to bash Curtis looking for two in a row. Quickly jumps to the inside. Got a good run here. Should he be pushing it? The 8 gave him the, gave the 7 to push, but oh, he tried to make the move to the inside. The 08 still trying to get the lead, but the 8 with the big push here. I don't know, I, don't, I didn't know you can do that at Atlanta. Avery, Avery trying to get that win. The 7 also trying to get the win. Leaving a little bit of, leaving that bottom wing open just a little bit, but I'm just thinking he's just trying to mess with him. Don't think he also should uh, run that higher lane, got a longer way around the track. The 6 car also trying to get it. Oh, the 7 going real low. He's going down pit road. No, he didn't. He looked really slow. And look at Ash Curtis. He just jumps out of nowhere. And he's trying to make 2 in a row. Brendan trying to get the lead. Lots of drivers in there. But remember that low side. And tonight's weather. It's no oh, the 10's around. Spinning. On the back stretch. Save it, save it. Saved it. Is the caution out? Yes, it is. That's it, the race is over. And I think people think I rigged the race now because the seven is part of my team. Well, unless he runs out of gas, he will not win this race for sure. The caution has come out for nothing. The 10 just spun and caution was called. Let's take a look. Gabe Williams and a 13 just dumps the 10 off the off of two. Right on the back stretch he goes and 
You pretty much saved it. So I'm get back on, to, uh, get, get it back straight there. But the caution just had to be called for that. Wow, perfect, isn't it? Well, people are gonna say I rigged the race, but I'm just guessing my team is good on these uh, type of tracks. That's the only tracks we win at. Never mind, just fuck it. So, uh, the 7 car has taken the win. Ash Curtis 2nd almost got 2. Avery got 3rd, 4th, Jacob 5th. Brenda 6th, Ashley 7th, Brian, he can't be happy. So, uh, I'm guessing he doesn't have to... Uh, you know what, never mind. You know what's gonna happen. 8th was the 11, ninth was the 89, and 10th is the 9 car. Two drivers did not finish on the lead lap. They were Looks like they ran out of gas or something like that. Here's the rest of the race uh, results. Man, a lot of good drivers had a chance to win this thing. They just got wrecked. So once again, 39 cars started the race. We'll take you to victory lane now. Oh wait, no, my driver. Never mind.